Welcome to the AACS Daily News for January 18th, 2017. The Attleboro YMCA is making some changes to its smallest winner program. It's now called the Shape Up Team Challenge. To find out more, we spoke with Lisa, who is a lifestyle specialist. I am the Healthy Lifestyle Specialist at the Attleboro YMCA Downtown Branch. I am also a personal trainer, group fitness instructor, and neurokinetic therapy practitioner. And I'm here to talk to you today about the Shape Up Challenge, Shape Up Team Challenge that we are now offering at the Y as our health and wellness program. It was formerly known as Smallest Winner, but we have now changed the name because we wanted to make this a program about making healthy choices, creating a healthier lifestyle, and making behavioral changes versus a weight loss program, which has been associated with Smallest Winner for quite some time. So we figured this program is really for anybody who wants to just start living healthier with the guidance of a trainer and our life coach that will be offering support and meetings every month. We want to stay away from focusing on just calories. We want to focus on making those healthy food choices, adding daily activity to your life, making the choices that are going to create a well-balanced workout routine and healthy lifestyle, and we feel that the weight loss will take care of itself. The other thing that we have done is we have taken Smallest Winner, which was 10 weeks. We have now made this a 12-week program. They're still going to see the great one-hour group trainings with their trainer, and they're also going to still have their one-on-one -on -one personal training session with their trainer. We've added more group challenges, so that famous fit challenge that we had was only one time. We are now doing them once a month to get the whole program together for a complete circuit workout for one hour. If they've been through the program, we have now added a life coach where they're going to be coming together again once a month to work on those behavioral changes and they're going to have the online support that they need. I have set up a Facebook page strictly for Shape Up Challenge participants. It's a closed group with lots of privacy. They're going to be able to come together for a little bit of nutrition seminars that we're going to be offering. Very basic nutrition. Um, we're going to be doing how to prepare food. We're going to talk about grocery shopping, menu planning, and just how to have a plan. Some of the people that have gone through the Smallest Winter continue to go through the programs, um, which now, again, is called Shape Up, because A, they like to have the accountability, and they like to be able to continue to work with the same friends that they met throughout from previous programs. We have seen people that have maintained that healthy lifestyle and con with continued success, and we also have seen people that just continue to need that help and guidance to make the, the healthier choices. So at the end of the program, we're going to come together and we're going to celebrate everyone's success and their hard work by gathering at the Norton Outdoor Center, where we'll be doing the ropes course, which involves climbing up a 40-foot ladder, jumping off a platform, zip lining, and we're going to end up with a cookout. And that will be our last lesson to how to lighten up the grilling to kick off summer, and that will be taking place the last weekend in April. This program starts February 5th. They can go to the Attleboro website, attleboroymca.org, or they can email me personally at lhooker at attleboroymca.org, or they can call 508-222-7422. That is the downtown branch. Come check out our Shape Up Challenge, because with a lot of mental and physical strength, heart, good attitude, a lot of positivity, and a lot of effort, you will shape up.